All right, hello everybody and welcome to episode 108 of my gateway experience. Let me move this over here. Thank you so much for tuning in. The purpose of these videos is to document our journey through the Monroe Institute's gateway experience. I like to call the gateway experience a scientific repeatable process of self discovery, self exploration and ultimately self master your self-actualization. It consists of a total of 36 tapes divided into six waves. We are currently on the third wave and we are on the first tape of that wave called the liftoff tape. So today was the fourth time doing this tape. If you haven't seen any of my other videos, go ahead and check those out. No, it was actually the fifth time. So there you go. That way you can see the journey so far so let's get straight into it right now it is 11 11 a.m magical number right there it is december 10th 2022 and today i woke up at 9 35 and today is a saturday it's a saturday today so saturday december 10th 2022 it is now 11 12 a.m and doing this tape this lift off tape for the fifth time what can i say well so far we've talked about how kind of it feels okay so it's really mainly focused on our resonant energy volume and we're sitting there soaking everything and being fully fully present and if we look at the tape that we did before, which was the living body map and the um, energy bar tool and the color breathing, okay, it all fits right in, okay? It's all right there and it's becoming more and more complex, higher, higher level as we go. Obviously, our, it's like uh, we're building up from our box, okay? We're expanding, really what we're doing is we're expanding our consciousness, but we're not just expanding our consciousness to think about bigger things, but we're also encompassing all of the small things along the way that make the bigger picture. Okay, so I think that's the best way for me to explain this liftoff tape, um, at least in a very coherent, uh, scientific, more so rational way, because we talked about the quantum portion of it, which science cannot even touch. Um, we talked about the uh, kind of precognition, extrasensory perception, right? So it's when we're vibrating at that higher gamma level, we can perceive things that maybe other people cannot perceive. And that comes down to probability and things like that. I mean, our brain are the, is the most complex supercomputer that there is on the planet. So um, it would take several artificial intelligences and by several, I mean like thousands and I'm not certified in this kind of stuff. So I'm just kind of throwing out numbers here. I really have no idea, but I'm for, as far as I know, it would take a considerable amount of energy and effort to create an artificial intelligence that is even comparable to us human beings because, you know, we don't have them yet. Right. So. This is where we're at and to, to, to really build up to this point where um, we can become aware of a higher level of intelligence. That's really what we're talking about. We're talking about a higher, higher level of awareness and uh, intelligence. It's like when you meet somebody, it's like everything about them kind of tells you a little bit about them you know, um, what they're wearing, the kind of, um, you know, they have hair on their face or whatever it might be, kind of tells you a little bit about them. It tells you a little bit about how they think, okay? Well, it's that, that, that DNA um, is in all living things, right? So we look at a leaf and we can break that down. Um, we look at the grass, we can break that down. I mean, anything and everything that we look at has like a little footprint to it. And um, I think that's what this lift off tape is really kind of pulling on, is really kind of building upon, is uh, the complexity of intelligence. 
and uh, the probability of things as well. As we continue to get more and more complex, um, I think it's going to be even more and more exciting. And the only it's going to be so complex that the only way to communicate will be through story. Okay, and um, because stories are really if a uh, if a picture holds a thousand words, then a video holds a thousand pictures, and a video is a story. So with a beginning, a middle, and an end. And I talked about this before as well, and we we talked about um, the the Vikings tape or the Vikings uh, videos, and um, about how. Uh, uh, Ragnar Lothbrok was about to venture out uh, across the, the, the sea there to uh, discover another part of Europe, is what it was. And somebody asked him, you know, like, hey, you know, isn't that just a story that you heard about this other place being there? How do I know it's even real? And the, he said, well, isn't that what all life is? Isn't that what everything is about? Isn't it all about a story? You know, and I think that's the most profound thing. So I want to challenge you guys. You know, um, I don't even know if that made any sense, what I what I just said, but uh, it made sense to me. So if it didn't make sense to you, just let me know if you have questions down below. And I want to challenge you guys to um, think about, you know, what it, and I know this is almost like too big of a thinking for a lot of people, I feel like. Uh, it's like, oh, that's that, I don't even worry about that. Or there's certain aspects that I can't control in order to make this true, so I don't even want to think about it. But what is the story that you want to tell your, your family, you know, people at your funeral or whatever it is, or, people, or you want people to tell about you, you know? What is that story? I think that's going to be what, my, what I'm challenging you guys on uh, today. So, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much everything I want to say on this topic. And... Uh, that's what lifting off is all about. It's all about seeing things from a higher perspective. So if you want to communicate with me, let me know in the comments down below. And until next time, I will see you guys soon. Peace.